Hey guys, today I will show you how PASIC Tsunami API works. So to try it, go here. You will first need to create an account. If you don't have one here in Harbor, I already have one, so I'll just straight into API reference. So Tsunami API is an ultimate blockchain data provider. Let's see how it works. Let's start with a simple query with just taking all the transfers for one address. Let's paste the address here, choose Ethereum network. Let's run the query from the first block to the latest. And let's try it. As you can see, in less than a second, we got all the transactions for this address. For fungible tokens, non-fungible tokens, native currency transfers. Now, let's make it a bit more specific. Let's take a look only at fungible tokens try it okay again you can see all the fungible token transfers for this address now let's look for something even more specific let's say we're interested not in a simple transfer or token transfer but in an arbitrary smart contract event let's say we want to say see all the times that this address set approval for all. So let's take this transactions logs. Let's copy topic zero. Let's go to fundamental data, events, chain ID Ethereum. Now we need to paste topic zero here. And also, we need the origin address because we don't want to see all the events with this topic zero, but only all the events for my address. Okay, let's try it. And you can see this transaction here. Let's compare transaction cache with the one that we see on Etherscan. Three to eight here, three to eight here. So, as you can see, we can not only monitor usual transfers and NFTs and fungible token transfers, but also arbitrary events. Also, for each query, as you can see, Tsunami API creates a code snippet for various programming languages. So, you can just embed code with the query into your code. And the last thing that I wanted to share today is our data lake concept. So when you're dealing with Tsunami API, you're basically dealing with raw data, but sometimes you need more specific data, process data for some specific protocols. Let's say you want for a protocol to see all the TVL. Okay, then we will calculate the TVL on our end and provide an access to it via the API. So the first data lake that we have is the NFT data lake and it basically allows us to check NFTs for ownership. So first of all, let's copy paste my address and let's inventorize all the NFTs on my address. Ethereum, try it. I have just one NFT on this address but we can not only see all the NFTs for one address, but also all the transfers for one NFT. So let's copy paste its contract address. Let's go to NFT transfer history. Paste the address here. Our token ID is 130. Ethereum network, try it. And yeah, you can see all the transfers for this NFT. Basically, it was minted from zero address to my address and it's there. So if you need some specific data for your protocol, we could structureize it and provide the access to it here in Tsunami API. That's it for today. Thank you for the time and have a good day, guys.